The chord progression in Beyond Beliefs is called the Plagal Cadence. This progression has been widely used for hundreds of years and is just a fancy way to describe moving from the four chord to the one chord. In the key of C major, that would be an F major chord to a C major chord. All the notes of the parent scale work well melodically over the two chords. When you add reverb and echo, it creates an epic cinematic sound. Beyond Beliefs uses a plagal cadence in the key of D flat. G flat major for four bars, resolving to D flat major for four bars. The four to one chord progression in Ben Boomer's Beyond Beliefs allows for the use of common tones, which are notes that you can hold while the chords change underneath. The two held notes are the one and five of the scale, D flat and A flat, which form a perfect fifth. As the bass note moves from the root of the four chord, G flat, to the root of the one chord, D flat, the notes above stay the same. This creates a smooth gliding feeling, as these notes agree with both chords, though their relationship to each chord changes. Now that the chords follow the progression in Ben Boomer's Beyond Beliefs, we need to give them some rhythm. The pad plays a steady stream of 16th notes that emphasize certain beats. The pattern of the emphasized beats are 7 16th notes, 3 16th notes, 4 16th notes, and 2 16th notes. Next, we will maintain the rhythm while slightly shifting some notes so that there is some melodic motion. Use arpeggiator to fill in the rest of the 16th notes. Change the rate to 1 16th and gate to 94%. Turn on the often overlooked velocity setting and set decay to 11.5 milliseconds, and target to 1. Now, after each chord is triggered, the repeated notes fall at the rate set by the decay parameter to the velocity set by the target parameter. Lastly, change the style to chord trigger. This triggers the entire chord rather than the broken arpeggiations. 